Robert Sinstack Abbott, born November 24th, 1870, departed February 29th, 1940, was an American lawyer, newspaper publisher, and editor. Abbott founded the Chicago Defender in 1905, which grew to have the highest circulation of any black owned newspaper in the country. In 1929, Abbott and Killam founded the Bud Bickelin Parade and Picnic. It became an occasion for African Americans to celebrate their pride and connections. Abbott was seeking an atmosphere free of race prejudice. Even in religious communities, he sometimes found that mixed race African Americans who were light skinned sometimes also demonstrated prejudice against those who were darker. The Robert S. Abbott House in Chicago, where he lived from 1926 to his death, was designated as a National Historic Landmark in 1976. His childhood home in, Woodville, in the Woodville neighborhood, now in Savannah, Georgia, was designated as a City Historic Landmark. An early biography of him was published in 1959-55 by Roy Otley, The Lonely Warrior, The Life and Times of Robert S. Abbott. In 1963, painting, Robert Abbott found the Chicago Defender, artist William McBride, depicted a young Abbott finding the newspaper. The painting is now in the collection of the Du Sable Museum of African American History in Chicago. Abbott is featured in the documentary series Profiles of African American Success. In 2017, Abbott was inducted into the Chicago Literary Hall of Fame. And as always, if you learned anything, let me know below. If you liked the video, please give it a share and let your friends know about it. Thank you so much. Oh, oh no, oh, oh no, oh, oh no, oh, 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 oh, oh no,